In today's world, the pursuit of innovation and personal projects has led to the rise of homemade helicopters. While some individuals succeed in their endeavors, soaring through the skies with their creations, others face unfortunate outcomes. In this captivating video, we will witness a compilation of 20 instances where these homemade helicopters have failed to achieve flight. Jerry's unfortunate crash. Jerry, a passionate enthusiast of helicopters, embarked on a mission to build his own at home. However, during the testing phase, his dream took a nosedive as a helicopter crashed before it could even take flight. The disappointment and setback must have been disheartening for Jerry, but his determination may have fueled him to try again. The Kenyan test flight. In the capital city of Kenya, the man crafted his homemade helicopter and ventured to the northern part of the country for its test flight. This ambitious project showed promise as the helicopter successfully lifted off and maneuvered through the air. However, tragedy struck during landing when the trail boom of the helicopter failed to withstand the force resulting in a crash. Fortunately, the man survived the accident without sustaining any major injuries, perhaps thanks to the protective helmet he wore. A congested attempt. In the bustling city of Kathmandu, Nepal, an individual named Mi attempted to fly their homemade helicopter in a congested area. Unfortunately, their lack of flying skills and the sustainable location posed a serious risk for crashing. It serves as a reminder that careful consideration of the environment is essential when testing such ambitious creations. The aesthetically pleasing helicopter. Venturing to Vietnam, we encounter a unique homemade helicopter that stands out with its striking appearance. The creator went the extra mile, adorning the helicopter with well-structured frame, a front mirror, and a fantastic paint job. However, despite its appealing aesthetics, the rotor blades were too short to generate enough lift. Consequently, the helicopter crashed without ever achieving flight. Thankfully, the inventor emerged unharmed. Nigeria's beautiful, yet grounded helicopter. Nigeria presents us with a visually stunning homemade helicopter that failed to fulfill its purpose of flying. While its appearance captivated viewers, the helicopter could only send their hopes soaring, not itself. It serves as a reminder that looks can be deceiving and functionality is paramount in such ventures. Joseph's Tenacity in Uganda In Uganda, we meet Joseph, an African inventor who invested an incredible amount of time and effort into building his steel version of a homemade helicopter. Over 14 years, he meticulously assembled a 5 meter long aircraft using old motorbike and miling machine parts. Despite his dedication and application of electronic mechanics, he faced repeated accidents and setbacks. His journey began with an idea of an electric fan. His journey began with an idea of an electric fan and evolved into a sophisticated project. Each design brought about improvements, but none allowed for successful landing. Joseph's unwavering determination speaks volumes as he refuses to give up on his dream of achieving flight. The call for government support. Joseph's story brings to light the need for external support and investment in such ambitious projects. With over 50 million shillings already invested, Joseph still requires an additional 26 million shillings to refine his helicopter. He recognizes the potential of aluminum as a lighter and wind-resistant material, and he calls upon the government to provide assistance and access to advanced technologies. The quest for flight should not be shouldered by individuals alone. Collaborative efforts can pave the way for success. The African Mechanics Prototype a highly ambitious mechanic from Western Africa set out to create a homemade helicopter behind his parents' home. 
the rotor blades seem promising, raising hopes for a successful flight. However, despite their initial potential, the blades fail to meet the required aerodynamic specifications, preventing the helicopter from taking to the skies. Swazi Test Flight A determined inventor from Swaziland, South Africa, conducted a test flight of this homemade helicopter. Sadly, the results were less than ideal, as the helicopter did not achieve the desired level of flight. Although a pilot was not on board during this particular test, it was a significant step in the inventor's journey toward perfecting his creation. The Wooden Airplane While the video primarily focuses on helicopters, there's one notable incident involving a homemade wooden airplane. Despite its small size, the maker believed that it had the potential to fly. Crafted predominantly from wood materials, the airplane was powered by a boat engine. Although the outcome of the flight test is not revealed in this video, this unique deviation from homemade helicopters showcases the diversity of ambitious aviation project. Andrew Jerry's unique helicopter variation. Andrew Jerry, also from Nepal, designed an intriguing variation of a homemade helicopter. Notably, the placement of gears was unusual, located upwards in an unconventional manner. While this design may have sparked curiosity, the helicopter itself was unable to achieve flight. However, one can't help but notice the flag displayed proudly on the aircraft, showcasing the inventiveness and national pride of its creator. The plea for support. Joseph's story from Uganda highlights not only his personal determination, but also the need for government support and investment in such projects. Despite encountering numerous setbacks, Joseph refuses to abandon his dream of achieving flight. His plea to the government for assistance in acquiring advanced technologies and resources is a reminder that collective efforts and backing can significantly contribute to the success of homemade helicopter projects. Now join us next time for even more captivating content. Also don't forget to subscribe and stay tuned for more amazing videos.